Track one, testimony. Skills and all the lyrics, cause this my accident. So I'm dying so I can live, so I can live, I resurrect it. I'm dying so I can live, so I can live, I resurrect it. So like my life broke. I've been running these streets, got me dehydrated. I've been living so crazy, feel like I'm dying, babe. Blood in my eyes, I'm going blind, oh, blind, oh. Stuck in these streets, feel like my life broke. I've been running these streets, got me dehydrated. Why is it sound like he's all beat, man? I don't know what it is. It's like it just sounds like he's off beat just a little bit, but at the same time he's on it. This forever. Identity thief. You see, Kodak, you can't say shit like that when you got this charge on you, man, because if they hear this song, they're probably going to use this shit against you in court or whatever. And then even more screwed than you already are now. This is not it. Jesus Christ. Gnarly featuring Lil Pump. Oh God. Alright, that sounded like some hood high school musical shit right there. One, two, three, let's get gnarly! Come on. I'm trying guys. I mean I know it's only the beginning of the track, but that chorus right there is fucking atrocious. Like, I'm sorry. Like <laughs> one, two, three, let's get gnarly. Like what the fuck? Are you that that purple fish from SpongeBob? A gnarly dude! Oh, oh. Like what the fuck's wrong with you? Cook is fucking atrocious. Like, I can't. One, two, three, let's get gnarly. Like, come on, dude. The dislikes just went already done. I can already feel it. It's easy. You already heard it. I love the beat to this shit, man. Listen to it a couple more times. They should let the beat play a little bit, but. Take one. I'm pussy biting me if you want to sing a song. I can do the, the dance with this shit too. Mosh Pit featuring Juice World. Juice World is like it's sprinkled in every single song like it's fucking salt. Like the finishing touch. Oh my god, bro. Transgression. Malcolm XXX. Oh man. I can already hear people saying a lot of shit about this song title, bro. Yeah, 
I like this. I like this. That's true too. I generally like that track a lot. I really do. So I'm pretty sure that's two official Kodak Black songs I like a lot. This song and ZZ. That was a good track. I fuck with that. That, that was like Calling my spirit. <laughs> Yo, this is actually pretty good. I'm not even in front. The second half of the album is really good. I'm not even in front. Wow. In the flesh. The fucking beat selection of this man, bro. Oh my god. The beat's like colorful. Like. I can't really say anything else. Like the beat itself is colorful, man. Yo, his 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 production selection, bro. Like whoever he he, he hires to make beats for him, man. He he chose the right one, man. Cause he's flowing over it. Everything about this shit, man. I like this shit a lot. Right. Close to the grave. Man, Kanye's wildin' on Twitter right now, bro. I keep getting, I got like five notifications from this motherfucker, bro. Jesus Christ. Yeah, another one. Another one. His voice is terrible, but it works at the same time. Like, he knows he can't sing, but he makes it work enough to actually sound listenable. From the cradle. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on, dude? <laughs> Why do I like this shit so much? If I'm lying, I'm flying. Apparently, this was a single he put out a long time ago, but I didn't listen to it, so. Uh, Kanye, cup stop. <laughs> the beat. Why do I fucking like this so much, man? Why, why do I like this so much? I, I don't get it. I, it. There must be something wrong with me, bro. There must be something wrong with me, bro. This shit isn't normal for me. This shit is not normal for me. This. This shit is not normal for me, bro. Like, <laughs> dude, I, I used to not like this nigga a lot, but this album is actually, the second half of this album is really good. I'm not even gonna front. Needed something. Message is good, but how he delivered it, straight mold. Not did not like that track. I'm sorry. I get what he's saying. I get what he's saying. Maybe part of the reason why I like this so much is because he's actually formulating his words and that can actually understand it. Maybe because he's sober now. Straight call third. Kanye, we get it. God damn. Could have been different. He's rapping too fast on the beat, bro. Like, he, he sounds off beat as fuck. Get a little bit more to the beat, man. You know what I can see on this on this beat? Lupe Fiasco. Either Lupe Fiasco or like Wiz or um. 
B.O.B. I Was Dying to Live by Kodak Black. Not a bad album at all, man. That first half was kind of, uh, how can I put it, dumpster? But the second half, that second half, yeah, that second half right there, just shifted this entire project right into the lane it was supposed to go. Like this first, like two, three tracks, just like this kind of steering a little bit off the, off the lane, like you like sliding off the wheel a little bit, but then you guys you wake up and you just on the lane and you just focus the entire time. This sounds like a focus album. I think this is his first project when he's actually 100% sober, I believe. So congratulate Kanye. So congratulations Kodak. Respect to you for that, man. This album's not that bad. I'm not really gonna front. It's a pretty cool album. I like it at least. I mean, what tracks don't I like? Right here? The tracks I think are dumb sorry are Identity Thief, uh, Gnarly. That ugh, ugh. you could have just done that without that one, Kodak. Like for real, Gnarly was straight, not gnarly. That shit was straight dumpster. Like that shit was that shit belongs in the trash, bro. You can. Trash that shit, bro. I don't know why you put it on the album, bro. And needed something, like, needed something. The message is good, but as far as how he delivered it, nah. Needed something was literally what I didn't like about Kodak and how he delivers his, his message. Like, I just didn't like that at all. Like, that's the shit, the little crooning bullshit he does. I didn't like that. I don't like that. And that's exactly what he did on that. But that's pretty much it. So, my react. Oh yeah, and look out for the top 10 videos, they're coming either this week or today's Friday. Probably, I'm gonna start them probably Saturday, but I know for a fact they're coming out maybe, like most likely next week, most likely. So look out for the top 10s, top 10 worst and the top 10 best albums of the year, along with singles and worst singles, so.